Welcome back to the He's Wrong, She's Right podcast. This is a very, <laughs> by the way, get it on the store. Oh, you got a compliment on it today. I went to the store and a guy very awkwardly, <laughs> if he looks up the shirt, I hope you don't see this, but dude, you were kind of awkward. Um, very awkwardly meets me at the, the sliding doors. And it was like staring at me and smiling. And I'm like, hey, <laughs> maybe I didn't know you, but I, I didn't say that. But I, like, I'm thinking in my head, like, who is this person that's like clearly waiting for me to be like, hey, Bob, how you doing? Bob. I'm just making a word. <laughs> and uh, then he was like, he like stops for a second. And I'm like, how are you? And he's like, love the shirt, man. And I was like, thanks. It's from my podcast. <laughs> and I just kept walking into the store. So yeah, got a compliment. First day out in it. Is that a compliment? Yeah. Doesn't matter if they're weird. Okay. All right. <clears throat> so this episode is going to be fun. Okay. He literally gave yep. me no context yep. other than you should be scared. Yeah. Because I didn't want to clue you in on anything. Now I'm fucking terrified. I didn't want to clue you in on anything because then I knew it would impact your appearance right here. I'm, I took my ring off again. <laughs> Oops. Were um, you single at the store too? No. You know what goes on my sunglasses, which always go with me, so I always have my ring and my sunglasses. Sure. Um, so today, we're going to do a format I've never seen this done anywhere. Okay. Okay. And I think it's going to be very, very difficult for you. Very easy for me. Okay. But you're going to have a real hard time. So basically, unless you have autism brain, it's going to be terrible? No. Once oh. I explain to you the rules. Like the rules? Yeah, the rules. By the way, this is Nona. I'm Andrew. We're your hosts. You're exhausting. <laughs> All, right. All right. So here's how this goes. Okay. The entire show, we have to compliment each other and talk about nice things about each other without being sarcastic or laughing, breaking in any way. You have to look right at me or right at the camera, say something <laughs> nice. Okay. Every time you laugh, you got to put like $10 in the kids' um, savings. Okay. Deal. College fund. Deal. Okay. All right. So, <clears throat> since you just learned the rules, who do you want to start? You. You're very beautiful. Thank you. You're supposed to go next. Oh, I appreciate you for going to the store for me. Thank you for going to the store for me. To buy air filters. Air filters, yes. Which this house is dumb. It has four uh, air returns, and they're three different sizes. So I have to buy three different size filters every time. Okay. You're very tall, and you. <laughs> That's not a compliment. That's an observation. It's a compliment. That's not a compliment. Yeah. That's an observation. And you, <laughs> what you know the that picture of us that's circulating from the beach. Oh yeah. Yeah. Miss Piggy, oink oink. Yeah. Okay. What about it? That's how we are in real life, right? That I'm taller than you in you're real like, life. You're like seven foot four, and I'm six foot three. <sighs> okay. Wait, did I just lose because I laughed? Yeah. Yeah, you got to put 10 bucks. But technically, you were not giving me a compliment. Technically, it was just an observation. No, I was giving you a compliment. Okay, if that's <clears throat> the case, you have a beard. See how that works? But is it? I said you were tall right. because women like to be tall. I don't want to be tall. You don't want to be tall? No. Okay. Because I can't wear heels without being six foot fucking three. You're still shorter than me. You're like a midget. Okay, but I yeah. tower over everybody else. So? So the point being, just because you made an observation that. doesn't mean that We're it's laughing. a compliment We're laughing. to me. We're laughing. You're not allowed to laugh. Stop laughing. <laughs> this, isn't, this isn't a joking matter. We're being very honest with the audience. Okay. Okay. Very transparent. Yes. Whose turn was it? Your turn? My turn? 
I just gave you an observation no, back. You have to you have to quantify or qualify the beard. You can't just say beard. You quantified my height. Yeah. I said I like your height. Mm, you didn't say that in your original statement. That you're, was a follow up. You're tall and I like it. Because okay. I don't have to lean over to kiss you. Okay. Okay. I guess t- technically that would be a compliment. <laughs> I am not hurting your neck and back by having a decent enough height for you. Exactly. You are not hurting my eyeballs for having hair on your face. You guys hear this? This is what I deal with every day. <laughs> That's 20 bucks. Breaking down over here already. Can't even can't even make it. What are we at? What? <laughs> not even six minutes in. All right. <clears throat> you better get a piece of paper to... Um, I can just type it out. Okay. It'll work. I, I didn't that, even bring my phone over here. Otherwise, I, I'd be transferring this live. One. <laughs> wait. No, you're at two. N, two. All right. It's $10 per kid. A. Each time. And it'll just be a constant rotation. Sure. Okay. I have the scoreboard. Okay. So it's I already notepad. have to transfer $20 yep. into now two children's bank accounts. Yep. Okay. Okay. Is it my turn? Yeah. Okay. Your turn. You have very amazing squeezable boobies. That's what she said. Rude. They heard the gulping. That's what I said. <laughs> I was quite literally swallowing a laugh. That's what she it said. took all of my power to not laugh at that. Okay. You have very squeezable. <laughs> it wasn't supposed to be sarcastic, remember? <laughs> I knew she wasn't going to make it. This is why I didn't warn her. She was like, we need to have a production meeting. And I was like, if we're only doing one episode right now, no. Oh, God. Okay. So is that three? Mm-hmm. <laughs> but I have to transfer. Okay. Okay. I like, wait, is it my turn? Yep, it's your turn because I gave it back to you. You have very squeezable boobies. That's my no, because that's No, because that's a sarcastic <laughs> one. You don't, hold on, let me update the math. That's what math. I laughed at. <laughs> yeah, I, but, didn't, I held the laugh for when you, you gave it to me. You broke And the I rules, gave though. it back. Yeah. yeah, but you're breaking the rules. You're not supposed to be sarcastic. It's supposed to be real, and you have to actually be honest and I, give real compliments. I am being honest. I'm being very raw and honest. Okay. Okay. <clears throat> For the audio audience, once again, you should switch to video <laughs> format. You're laughing, and we, I didn't even say anything. Picturing them in their car listening to this. Well, Spotify. <laughs> I don't. Do you, so. You use Apple. I'm gonna segue here real quick. Does Apple pull in the video from? Because that's Spotify is the mm-hmm. host for Apple, Amazon, it's etc. Anything mm-hmm. that's not YouTube or Rumble oh is coming from cool. Spotify, and Spotify has the videos. You can play video on Spotify, but I don't have those other apps. So I don't know. Mm-mm, no. Okay. Anyways. 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 I like the way that you look at me on the podcast. When I watch the video back. It's not, it's not just on the podcast. That's how I look at you always. Do you guys believe that? Do you think that she actually looks at me that fondly in public? But it's, it's that you actually are seeing a playback of it, whereas you see me actually looking at you. Yeah, but when you look at me a lot of the time on the podcast, you're like smiling in your eyes and you're like, I love him so much. What do you guys think? They agree. They agree. They know. They see it. They comment on it. Right. That's the point. That's how I've always looked at you. Always. 
I've literally what, always looked at you that way. Do you way. guys think she looks like at me like that off camera? <laughs> Be honest. <laughs> Comment. Let me know. Comment. I want to. I want to know if people actually if they actually buy it. I want to know. Well, you can pull up all of our original pictures from when we even first met. Yeah, but those are all staged because they're pictures and we're doing like selfies. When have we ever actually had a picture taken by somebody else? Or like, did we, did we ever see any of the pictures from uh, Paul's wedding? I, don't I never did. Whether you did or not, I don't know. I don't know if he ever posted them because that would be like the only time that or Rachel's wedding. Those would be basically other than the kids taking a picture because you want them to take a picture of us. <laughs> those would be like the only two, right? I can't think of any other time somebody was just taking pictures and we would have been in them. Yeah, I can't think either. Unless it's on like somebody's ring doorbell or something while we're standing there. <laughs> and they took like screenshots of it. Yeah, that would be Still creepy. Them. Please don't do that. You know people do that kind of stuff. Really? Yeah. Yeah. I don't know. Now I need people to comment. Are you guys creepy and take pictures of people standing out in your driveway and on your front porch? You know they do. You know somebody has a spank bank of just like their <gasps> UPS driver. Ooh, what? Yeah, yeah. You know. <laughs> oh, that's never even crossed my mind. So obviously, yeah. no, I don't know that. You know it's true. Oh, right. you guys are disgusting. Right. Back on topic. Okay. Okay. Um, wait, is it my turn? Yeah, it's going to be now just because I don't know. <laughs> yes, you said last that you like the way that I look at you on the podcast, okay. not in real life. Sorry about that. Kick the whole table. Yeah, no, sorry about that for that uh, specification. Did that count as sarcasm? <laughs> Whoops. What specification? You specified you like the way that I look at you on the podcast, oh. alluding that I don't look at you in real life like this. I'm just going to mount cameras in the house to see how you that's look so at That's so creepy. <laughs> I'm sure you, ew, no, that's we so have creepy. All the security cameras and stuff from the other house are in there. Right, Been that's so there. creepy. I don't ever want cameras inside Well, the those house. are all outdoor cameras, but they will work yeah. inside. I don't ever want inside cameras. So By the creepy. way. We Such have other cameras. We just had two sets. Now we have one set from the old house in a box, and the other ones are still set up here. So don't think that I'm slacking. No, definitely not slacking. Your turn. Okay, sorry. My turn. Um, I appreciate and I love that you take the children to school for me every single day and allow me to have 30 minutes of coffee and chill time uninterrupted in a quiet house. You're welcome. Thank you. Hmm. I should have prepared more. It was my episode. <laughs> I like when you flash your boobies at me <sighs> when I'm doing nothing, sitting on the couch and just. <laughs> <laughs> I'm basically going to laugh every time you say boobies. You know this. Well, <sighs> that's another point. Because you're just a child. Your turn. Wait, how much money am I up now? You've laughed at least six times that I've counted. Okay. Okay. All right. Um, hmm. 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 Make me push the button. You had to think on the last one for... Yeah, but I have the buttons and you don't. You're going to reach all the way over here and push the button? I actually don't even want to be on this. Here we go. I have, this one's queued up for you. I love how 
big your butt is. <laughs> oh, you you owe the children money now. I just I put it on the list. Thank you. You're welcome. You guys will never see it, but it's a badonk. It has its own zip code. So what happens when you actually play outside as a kid and are corn fed. Corn fed. Swim, run, walk, bike everywhere every day. A badonk donk. Other outside of all these lazy kids these days that don't even know that the sun exists. Hmm. Hmm. I like that way it is my turn, right? Yes. I like when you're nice to me. <laughs> you gonna I gonna say anything? Thank you. Okay. I really should memorize. You are welcome. I should memorize what all the buttons are sometime. I know this one for sure because I use it all the time. And I know where the the bleep button is on the next page. Mm -hmm. But I like don't even know what the rest of them really are. I don't know what any of them are. You should know. Here. Then here you go. This one makes me here, a DJ. Here's my next one. Okay. I appreciate all of your hard work on this podcast. There you go. You owe money now. Fine. You're welcome, children. Yes. You're welcome. Literally over here sacrificing my dignity for your bank account. What? All right, what? you owe more money no, now. You just left again. Nope. That counts as one nope. laugh. That counts nope. as one, that counts as one nope. laugh, right? Absolutely not. That counts as one laugh. Nope. Okay. The rules say each laugh. You made up the rules. Well. Well. I'm not giving you any slack then. You just lost it. You didn't give me any slack to begin with. Is it my turn or your turn? It is your turn. I just gave you the last one. Mm, I enjoy when you cuddle with me. Really? Yeah. You're secretly a cuddle bear? Wait, wouldn't that, if you cuddle with a teddy bear, which one's on the inside? If you're a small spoon, are you, is the big spoon the bear? No, I was just saying in general that you pretend to be all tough on the exterior, but on the interior, you're secretly all mushy. It just means I get to touch you. Oh, okay. So it's ulterior motives. So that way you can squish my boobs. Understood. Well, I know that your favorite thing is when I lick your face and do weird stuff like that that bugs you. It is literally the most disgusting thing in the entire world when he licks my face. I don't like anybody touching my face, breathing on my face, <laughs> being I, anywhere close I to my face. I walk up to her and go, boop. <laughs> and when he licks it. Instant repulsion. Except those are laughs. I can, that, I I can hear you sucking those laughs back down your windpipe. No. I can hear them. No. The children's bank accounts appreciate I did not each laugh. I did not laugh. time you breathe a laugh. laughter. Okay. At the end, I'll give up my tally. Okay. And then they can comment and give their tally. Okay. Because I'm definitely not going to watch the episode after I edit it. I don't even watch it when I edit it. You hear this, guys? I just complimented him on his hard work only to find out he doesn't do jack fucking shit. I do when I edit it, but I don't like, I don't watch it. Most of it's automated. I know exactly where I'm going to put stuff and timings and things like that. Okay. Okay. So, so. it's your turn. Princess. Okay. Please don't call me that. Princess. <laughs> I love how 
tall you are. Thank you. You're welcome. It took me a lot of effort. To grow? Sure. What do you mean a lot of effort? I had to eat a lot of food growing up. You know how, you know how much energy it takes to eat a lot of food? It's really time consuming. But it's literally your favorite activity. No, I'm just hungry. Okay. That's, that's like uh, um, all those like cartoons and stuff when we were kids. Mm-hmm. The main character is like always hungry and just is always eating. You got Shaggy from Scooby-Doo. Okay. You got those um, action characters that eat their like ramen really, really fast. Okay. Uh, yeah, like literally everything. People are always eating. So I'm, they're the hero. I'm the hero. I have to eat. It's a requirement. That's it. Suck it in. There you go. I really want to do, I really want to do with these buttons, but I need to figure out what they all are. The hero. You are the hero of your own story. I am. Your turn. Okay. I was waiting for you to say that. They're going to be like, what the fuck did he just say? I was waiting for that. They're going to be wondering what I was saying that whole time. And my compliment. Do you need me to censor it? Has to do with what you just said. Do you need me to censor it? I'll just leave it at that. Do you need me to censor it? Oh, you're not going to say it. I, unless you want to press the button while I say it. They're going to try and read your lips now. Okay. They're going to be motivated to read your lips. Ready? (laughs) They definitely read that. (laughs) See, at least in mine, I'm usually like right here. So you can't actually even see my lips. I'm like, yeah, they, they 100% read your lips just then. Tell us what you guys think she said in the comments. What, what time are we at? So this is kind of, this is, uh, okay, I know. I like when you get all prettified, made Prettified? Up. Yeah. When you do all your fanciness. So nine out of 10 times, I look like a complete slob kebab because I work from home. So he's saying the one no, no, other no, no, time. No, 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 Don't, no, no, no. When no, I no. don't look like a slob kebab. You're not waiting. You got to let me finish. Okay. Like when you get all prettified mm-hmm. and then you wear those dresses that have the boob window. To be clear, it's a dress that shows cleavage, but then also has like the thing that goes over the top literally one dress i don't have all the dresses i just have well you also have the sports bras and stuff it's all the same thing to me okay okay the boob window is the best the boob window that is his compliment is that i provide a decent boob window for him to it's view it's yeah it's a um uh what do you call that Never mind. I'll come back to it. All right. You guys decide if that was actually a compliment. Everything that I say to you is a compliment. Come on. Let's be honest here. I'm the nicest person you've ever been in a relationship with. You know how I know that's true? Because all of those relationships ended. Doesn't that technically count as sarcasm? So technically you need to deposit $10 into each of their bank accounts at this point. That wasn't sarcasm. That was truth. That was the truth. You know, it was the truth. Every other relationship has ended and you're still with me. What do you guys think? They think we're going to be together forever. You know, no, um, I was asking if they thought that oh, it was said in okay. sarcasm. Okay. Yes, it might be a factual <clears throat> statement, but it was said in a sarcastic way. So 
I just saw, and I, I didn't know who the person was until I saw this. And I, I might have taken a screenshot. And I think it was going to send to you, but it was late, I think. Like um, after I went to bed, so you yeah. knew I wouldn't see it? Yeah. Okay. So this guy, I think he's a YouTuber or something. Um, no, it was on Twitter. Posted that he and his uh, girlfriend broke up. Okay. I was like, I know this is like devastating for our fans and everything. I was like, um, for one, I don't even know how you came up in my feed because I don't know who you are. Okay. And for two, nobody cares about your relationship. Okay. I was nice though and I didn't actually send the tweet. I thought about how to say it in a very nice way to be like, nobody cares. But then I was like, He's probably in mom's basement right now. He's probably crying. He might be, um, oh my God, I can't think of the term. There's a term for people that cry and masturbate at the same time. Oh, yeah? Did not know that there was a term. (laughs) I was trying so hard. Boom. But you laughed first. You laughed first. I held it. <laughs> no, you technically laughed first. Oh. I heard the <laughs> over there while I was Fine. breathing through it. You had a you had a laughing breakdown there. Yeah, he was definitely using his tears to masturbate. They don't work well as loop, I don't think. It's like salty. Be abrasive. Sounds like you're speaking from personal experience, no, Andrew. No, I wouldn't do it for that reason. Okay. Did you imagine walking in on somebody and that's what they were doing? Like literally. All right. <laughs> you owe all the dollars now. More dollars. <laughs> add more. Because you're it. still laughing. I added it. That counts as one. Are you sure about that? Yeah. Are you sure about that? Yep. All right. It's What's your that turn. from? Mm, I don't know. Oh, well, if anybody wants to know what I'm doing, I'm playing with a S, S beaner. Your turn. No, it's your turn. No, I I did the last one. You did? Mm-hmm. No, I did. Oh, boob window. Sorry. Hmm. I thought we were still on what I said that you bleeped out. Okay. Um do, 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 do. Hmm. That's that is the sound that I need to get since I do it all the time so I can actually hit the button. It plays in my head rent free. I, I wonder though if I would get a copyright strike. Ah, uh, possibly. Have to do a uh, have to do shitty flute version. There you go. If you guys don't know what shitty flute is, it's okay. a recorder that plays all those songs that you know and love terribly. Then that is my compliment. For you. That I have a shitty flute? moment. That I have a shitty flute? I appreciate that you inform the children and I of all the random bullshit in this world. Cultural phenomenon. That we had never heard of, nor would we ever know about had you not stepped foot into our lives. Cultural phenomenon. Phenomenon. I bring the culture to the family. Thank you. We appreciate your very cultured. See, but the terrorists would call me an uncultured swine. But I call them, but I call them uncultured sheep fuckers. So anyways. Anyways. I like your eyes. They like glisten. Thank you Even, for liking my eyes. They're, they're very beautiful. They glisten. They like they have that like sparkle. 
You know when that effect is added in like movies and stuff? Yeah, yours do that like in real life. And it even plays the sound in my head. I can hear it. You hear my eyes sparkle? Yeah. Okay, that's a better compliment than I like your eyes. It's all in the delivery, Andrew. I said the words. Your turn. I bet you can't think of anything else nice to say. Mm. She's going to say something like, you have skin. Come on. Come on. Thank you, Andrew, for having 10 fingers and 10 toes. <laughs> Having that one toe thing you showed us the other day. I'm still haunted by how terrible that was. I sent that to every person I know that hates feet. <laughs> Who do you know that hates feet? First of all, like, why do you know that about them? Because people post about it and talk about it. It's like a, it's like a thing. It is burned into my you have, there's brain. A, there's a portion of society. And I just looked down at your foot to verify that you still have I just actually took a picture of my of feet a minute toe. ago. I just took a picture of my feet a minute ago. Why? Are you going to go on Feet Finder or whatever it's called? I didn't know that was a thing, but no. Um, yeah. One of the, this guy has a YouTube channel okay. that I just subscribed all of the channels to because he just like broke a hundred okay. And some people that I know, they're like, you should follow this guy. And I was like, who is he? And then they showed me a video of him doing, in, what is that, aerial cartwheel where you like flip, but it's like a cartwheel. Okay. And it's like the whole, it's like the perfect weapon. It's like sandal, something along those lines. I don't know. So, but then when I clicked on his page, I saw that the pinned comment was talking about combat flip flops. And there I am wearing combat flip flops. Uh, so I took okay. a picture and I was like, check him out. Gotcha. Yeah. This happened when I was outside with the dogs. That's what I was doing. Cute. I was taking a picture of my feet and blurring, Dirty out, blurring out my toes. I, bl I blurred out my toes. That way nobody could try and sell my feet pics. Struggle bus over there. Nobody wants to sell or look at your toes. And there, you. There's a weird section of society there's you have the people that are normal that are just like whatever a foot's a foot. Then you have people that are like terrified if you have your foot near them, mm -hmm. they have a full blown conniption fucking breakdown. And then you have people who want to suck your toes. Which which, which one fall? are you? <laughs> no, Andrew? I asked you first. I asked oh, you first. Just a foot is a foot. I don't care. Don't have a disgusting foot. Don't just, have one nubby toe. I just don't like touching people's feet. Yeah, he doesn't give me foot rubs, guys. He says feet are disgusting. Because they've been like walking around and there's like dog poop all over the floor and stuff. And what? The floor is disgusting. You know, like the, are you going to eat off the floor? Are you going to lick the floor? Do you hear this, guys? He won't. They know I'm right. Give me a foot rub. They know I'm right. Even fresh from the shower. You still, the shower is even more disgusting. The shower floor is literally the most disgusting place. Anyways. Go, go to, <clears throat> when you go to orientation, if I don't get to go, ask him for a little Petri dish. And we'll, we'll do some samples. We'll send it to school with Cooper on, on his first day. And he can, that can be his first science experiment for school. All right. It's your turn for the compliment or nice sure? thing. I thought I said my thing. No, I said my thing. Mm, okay. Um, I enjoy and appreciate the one time a year when you say something nice to me, but it's like super genuine. See, I put on this whole show because I wanted her to say a lot of nice things in one t at one time so I could record it. One time a year? 
that you say like one like really really genuinely nice thing because i'm not i'm not one of those people that like what's what's it called when you're like seeking compliments what's that term there's a term for it fishing for compliments sure that's yeah seeking compliments yeah. same thing how do you think this episode is going to do do you guys like this format maybe next time we'll actually write stuff down and I just, I wanted her to be completely caught off guard. Like, I wanted this to be yeah, a struggle. I did I not want Yeah, I am completely her. caught off guard, obviously. Wait, how, how much money five. do I need it? Nine to five. Okay. Unless they have a different number. Okay. They're just going to make up a bullshit number. If they even make it this far in the video to know that I said that. You're holding back another laugh there? No, I'm just thinking about how much money I owe my kids. You can do it over time. No, I'll, I said if I had my phone in front of me, I would transfer it live right now. You were now. just going to do sit there and just consecutively do? Yeah. No, because then you actually wouldn't have laughed because then you would have had like this like reminder or you would have cackled even harder because you're providing your kids with a stable future. It could have gone either way. A stable future of $10? Hey. Okay. A penny saved is a penny taxed. Okay. Um, let's see my turn. I don't know what, if that means. Uh, that would have been a good one. I heard like a magical yeah. sound. Yeah. Bling. Yeah. That would have been a perfect one for you giving me a compliment. But instead... I appreciate that you are the family grill master. Hmm. That torch has been passed to cash. He assists you. He can't do it. He made me eggs for breakfast and they actually were eggs. It wasn't like danger, pretend to eat them. And then be like, oh, I'm not really hungry. No, like they were eggs. Yeah. Yeah. I believe it. Mm Mm-hmm. Did you tell him thank you? Yes. Are you sure? Yes. Are you sure? Yes. Okay. All right. Well, this has been an experiment. If you guys like this, maybe we'll make it more professional. Are we already done? Yeah. That's it? You have more compliments? No. (laughs) See? She can't think of any nice things. I, I used all of my brain power coming up with the... Aw, that's so nice Once of you. Once that I That's said so to nice you. of you. You're welcome. Thank you. You're welcome. So, yeah, if you guys, this will come out on Monday probably, unless, I don't know, you might. Nona's birthday episode is coming up. Nona's birthday episode is Thursday's episode because. I turned the big three five. Her birthday is. I'm officially an old lady. Her birthday is the Saturday of the week this episode comes out. Like the. Not two days from today when we're recording, but, or no, tomorrow's Saturday. What am I thinking? Next seven, eight days away. There we go. It's in eight days. We'll be on a boat out on the intercoastal island hopping for her birthday. If you're out on a boat island hopping on August 10th, come find us. It's a lot of, it, it's a lot of area to cover, but you know, come, you can try <laughs> Love you. I love you too. Now that you just invited the world to stalk us on my birthday. If anybody actually shows up, I would be shocked. If anybody watches this far into the episode, I'd be even more shocked. So thank you guys for watching. Um, Thanks for getting us over a thousand subscribers and none of will remember next time to show you her belly button. Goodbye.